Hey friends and welcome back to your girl Brittany and I am here with the last group of the shaped and belly swap that I hosted over on Instagram. Uh, as a recap, the ladies were in groups of four and they had to create two shaped embellishments, do a sequin mix and a mini slimline card. And if you missed out on the first two videos that I shared, I'll make sure I have those linked down below in the description for you. So our first one comes from Magali, and she is Magali Makes over on the gram, and this is how her cute stuff comes, and she has the tube uh, secret mix with a lot of goodness in here. We got the gold foam balls, we have the peppermint, we have some green, whites, and gold stars in there, really, really pretty. And I'm not going to take anything out because I don't want to mess up anything. So you can kind of see what she did here. Um, a lot of, we got a lot of stampers up in this piece up in here. And a uh, cute little girl dressed as a reindeer. And it says, time to get get your, it's just what I wanted face ready. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh my God, that's what I always wanted. Not. And then for her embellishments, she did these cute little cocoa um mugs how adorable she has the one with the snowflake and then one with the hearts in the center very very cute so again guys let's go check her out at next Magalini. we have lynette and you can find her at pen pal projects and this is how her swap comes and this is so cute so her sequin mix is just all the whites and iridescence with the little snowflakes in the center then she also added a little foam bow at the top and then her slimline card has the envelope in there already. And she has a little foam snowflake. It says Merry Christmas. And then her information, again, Lynette from Pen Pal Projects. And it just goes back in envelope like bloop. And then here is her um, cute packaging. She did the candlesticks. And this one here, she has um, Merry Christmas on there. And then with the little holly berries. And then this one, she did it in the silver Merry Christmas, the holly berries. And then you, this one does have the little flame. If you can kind of see, it fell off. So you're just going to have to reattach that. Whoever ends up getting it. But it's so super cute. Thank you so much for participating, Lynette. And again, guys, she is Pen Pal Project. Next one we have is Yancy. And you can find her at Yancy Creations. And these are the cutest little stockings. Oh, my gosh. And she has these cute bag toppers with the pink ruffle trim. And then this is really cute. This is like some kind of a tinsel garland. It's really pretty. It has like the clear with the snow speckles and then red and then she did some little paper layering with the christmas tree uh with ephemera and then the santa and the gifts it says ho 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 and merry christmas and we're gonna take a bit of a closer look so this is the one that yancy made for me and has the little bee on it i've been having such horrible issues trying to figure out the special ones that are made for me and um brenda if you are watching this video i did find the one that you said that I opened up that was incorrect so everything is all good thank you so so much sweetie but here's the cute little socket I love it it's so adorable and then so we have her sequin mix with all this cute yummy we have some little candy canes we have the white clay snowflakes we have green gold uh we have little gingerbread people red um we have like those like weird like confetti iridescent like cut up pieces i don't know what they're technically called but such a fun mix thank you so so much oh let's get to that in a second and then here is her slimline card it comes out on oh, this is so adorable it looks like she probably used her snow pen to add snow to the trees has a little penguin here and it says merry christmas to you and your family and then i love how she used the embossing folder and then um added the color to it to create that brick paneling in the background and then she also has the lights going up at the top there and then there is the inside so adorable and it goes back in the envelope like bleh. Super cute. And then her Adorable. embellishments. She did a sweater shaker. I love it. 
so cute she has little snowflakes and pretty much the same mix that you are gifted there's a candy cane a little present we have a little reindeer and it says mary with the flower and then here we have a little page flag with a tree in the background we have a cute little owl a star in the background that says jingle bells and the snowflake so adorable thank you so much yancy and guys go ahead and check her out at yancy next Creation. we have connie and you can find her at connie's crafty world over on the gram and this is how her stuff comes oh my gosh this is so adorable this little house and i cannot wait to see what she created because she made so here's one the one that she made for me and had the little letter b on it see i'm paying attention guys and i'm totally upcycling this tissue paper just saying super cute but this house oh my gosh and she added oh my goodness look at the little mini cookie cutters i've never seen these these are so cute i love it and she has a little house and then she um covered it up with some pattern paper and it says hot chocolate and then let me and grab here my... is her yummy mix Ooh. And we have a little Santa's, we have some peppermint, we have this really pretty um, glitter gold one, we have candy canes, and then we have the little green and yellow, or green and yellow, oh my gosh, green and red, we have ginger people, we have some iridescence, oh, such a fun mix, absolutely love it. Super cute, I love this little house, that is adorable. And then, this is her swap, and look at little ginger charm. Oh my gosh, <gasps> adorable! And then let me make sure. Of course, oh yeah, I forgot twenty four at the end of her um name. Connie's Crafty World twenty four, and of course I am going to love it, and I love this envelope pouch that she did. Now let's see. How can I open this without destroying it? So it's all nicely wrapped. Oh. oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Look at her. She is so cute. The little button eyes. Oh my gosh. And it says yummy. And she has little candy canes and peppermints. Some clay houses and ginger people. And then these cute little like fuchsia colored sequins. And then a bow at the top oh my gosh you are too cute i love it and then here is her other one omg she did some wire wrapping with some red thread it says christmas cheer on a um coffee cup we have some um leaves in the background and then she did like some um like noodle drop or glossy accent to the lid how cute and then this last little flip, OMG. So if we don't get the theme already, but this is just too cute. The little gingerbread family, and it says family at the bottom instead of her frame. Then she also has some jemmies on there. And then there's the inside. Oh my gosh, this is so, so adorable. Guys, make sure you go check out Connie at Connie's Crafty World. All right, 24. so last but certainly not least, we're wrapping up the whole entire swap. We have Alicia, and you can find her at Lil Paper Crafter. And this is how her swap comes in these super cute gift bags. How adorable are these gift bags? And then she added, look at this little snow. <laughs> I love it. It's so cute. And I'm very excited that she was able to participate. She did have um, some family stuff going on, but she was able to complete and send. So I'm very, very proud of you. Thank you so, so much. And let's take a closer look. So here's the one, one that she made me. for me. And again, here is her information. She's also a Stampin' Up! demonstrator. And then this is the bag. This is so cute. And then it has a little snowflake clothespin. And then she also gets it like, you know, the little nail stickers. And a little Santa, is that Santa face? Or these are just lips, these are lips, okay. I thought it was a face and I was trying to figure it out. <laughs> but those are cute, thank you so, so much. And then she also has the little Christmas tree um, ornament thingamajig. And I'm just trying to see how it opens so I don't open the wrong side because knowing me. All right, so, oh, so cute. We have this really cute, oh, little iridescent pink and white snowflakes. We have the um, 
pink sprinkles and then we have these little christmas tree um clay pieces we have the green trees oh uh, such a super cute mix i love it so stinking cute and then she has this eyelash trim on here and a ribbon decorating it all up so stinking cute and then here is her card she did say to me that she forgot that it was a mini slim line but i'm like um no one's gonna complain about having something a little extra so that is a-okay so she did make a regular slim line she has this cute little shaker with the silver and sprinkles in there she has some gems in the corner it says merry christmas and then it has a little reindeer make sure there's not a personal note uh oh she has um the information of the things that she had used um, for her swap. Because, again, she is a Stampin' Up! demonstrator. So, you'll see that inside of your card there. And then inside it says, Love and Joy come to you and may it last the whole year through. Super cute. And we have that. And then we have the embellishments here. I love this bag topper. It says, Season's Greetings with the snowflakes on there. And then she did rosettes um, because of the family issue that had happened. Um, gonna let it slide, but technically rosettes were a no-no. But um, they're still super pretty. Um, she has this really, really cute... I don't want to open it because I don't want the sequins and stuff to pop out. But she has this really cute foil silver base one. And then she has a rosette snowflake with the blue snowball trim and then same thing here but she has a pink one at the bottom and then she also added like the little flakes on the sides there to um give it like that snowy look really really pretty thank you so so much for participating guys make sure you go check out alicia at little paper crafter and while you're at it make sure you go check out Magalie at Magalie Makes, and then we have Lynette at Pen Pal Projects, then also we have Yancy at Yancy Creations, and don't forget to hook up Connie at Connie's Crafty World 24. Thank you so much for participating, ladies. It has been such a great time looking at all of your fun creations and getting the great ideas, and I'm sure all the viewers are getting ideas as well. And a big ups to all of you guys watching and supporting me and these ladies all at the same time. Much obliged. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye!